these 90 projects, 15 were chosen uh, to submit four proposals. And of these 15, only nine were actually published. I'm a China scholar. I went to law school. I studied anthropology of institutions, and I'm interested in international institutions. I, I actually don't know anything about computers to begin with, but that yeah, came with the territory. But so I could combine all of these different interests, and I'm also interested in gender and uh, the, as you may know, computers are mainly manufactured by young women. So uh, there's a whole gender aspect to it, which I was very interested in. From the viewpoint of international organizations, what are some of the things uh, that uh, should be kept in uh, mind here? I got interested in this project by being involved in a meeting at the ILO, International Labor Organization, where it was a question of what are the conditions for working people in China, mainly, uh, in the computer industry. And uh, it's clear that Chinese law doesn't apply very well. And the question is, who's going to apply labor standards, uh, ILO labor standards, or industry-based labor standards to this industry? Everybody is interested in evaluating uh, corporate social responsibility uh, in, uh, instruments because there's a lot of skepticism, even among those who are doing it, about whether this is the correct way to uh, go about regulating labor. Many people believe that standard state regulation is probably the better idea. people we're dealing with, especially in international organizations, but also in, in NGO networks, are extremely sophisticated and they, it's not, they don't lack knowledge. We are not providing necessarily knowledge that they don't have. What they lack is, what they can't do is say certain things that we can say because we're in academia. So one of the things we can do is shed a critical light, something that the actors in the field can't do. And that's one of the things academics can continue to do, is shed a critical light on these instruments and say, well, maybe this isn't working, and maybe you should shift back to other modes of regulations.